Yo. Come on, Christopher. Call me kid. Come on, Christopher. The two D's. <laughs> Yo. Ain't a lot changed since I was a youth I'm still ill even with vaccine It's lonely at the top I'm living single like I'm Maxine Shaw, I'm above the law Prone to set it off like Khadija What's the procedure with gun to your head? A smooth criminal I operate with minimal flaws Cinema quality This widescreen is realer than y'all I'm coming 8K to lay waste to be Why I know you crying, man <laughs> you know what I'm That's how that go I got that towel, man Back with Super Day We're on the bench here we go. This is the official unboxing Super Dave on the bench of the Terra Squad Air Force One. First off, you know, you know your boy. I, I, I'm a little extra. The first thing I did when I heard that the actual Terra Squad Air Force was coming out, I went on Fat Joe's actual store that he has up New York, and I purchased a couple extra accessories, you know, and one being a little trucker style hat as you see right there a little ts and it came fairly quick but it's nice you know so i like the quality of it right there you see you got the little terra squad on the side just a basic black and white trucker you know up new york but so i actually copped the t-shirt too and the t-shirt is actually to commemorate the actual shoe index coming out and it is a terra squad you see it got the T.S. and the Rockefeller because the actual shoe was to commemorate a game that actually never happened way back in the 2000s. You know, it was real hype, you know what I'm saying? But it was actual blackout in the, uh, New York City at the time. So the, the game actually didn't happen. So that's the whole purpose of the shoe was, you know what I'm saying, to kind of commemorate that game, you know. But also, you know, I follow Fat Joe a lot because, you know what I'm saying, I listen to a little of his music, but more for him in the sneaker culture because he always kept that heat. And this shoe originally came out back in 2005, you know, in the 2000s, 2005. He had a whole collection. He got a whole story he was telling about how he knew somebody at Nike and they did a bunch of shoes for him illegally, you know what I'm saying, which is pretty dope, man. Actually, you know what I'm saying, that colorway was back then too, but he brought it back out to commemorate that actual game, you know what I'm saying. But like I said, I copped a shirt too, you know what I'm saying, from up New York. That's dope. I'm feeling that, you know what I'm saying. I'm really feeling that. I can't re wait to rock this. Throw that to the side. But uh, getting to the review, like I said, this box reads Air Force One Low Quick Strike TS. And this color is white, black, white, and black. And he actually dropped three colors. He dropped the black and white, and then he dropped the white and blue, which is the loyalty. Then he dropped the friends and family exclusive, which I've been trying to look for, but I ain't found. But I'm going to find it, though, because I love my Air Forces, too. But anyway, you know what I'm saying? He dropped three colors, but this is one of the ones right here. This is the blackout one. You know, I be talking too much about shoes, but I don't care. You know what I'm saying? I just love shoes. But this shoe overall is woo. It's nice. This is clean. So we're gonna get these right out the box. They come in basic, this uh Nike, you know what I'm saying, Air Force papering with the little star printed paper, you know, with the little uh all and the little exposed right there to establish 1980, you know, 82, the year the Air Forces came out. Get these out the box. Said this the basic Nike box. I ain't mad. I like I like it because Nike be bringing these boxes back. Because this was uh, the old Nike uh, Air Force boxes used to look like before they went to that. I think that's what they in gray now, I think. Gray and black boxes. Really can't remember. Because uh, they be coming in all kind of crazy uh, boxes. But, like I said, this one right here. I didn't look at this shoe when I first got it, but I ain't looked at it. So, this is like truly my first like into real look into this shoe, you know what I'm saying? Other than what I saw other people on their reviews do. But this shoe is nice. Even though it's a, just a basic black and white colorway, I like it. The quality of it is nice. I love how he went back with the old school, back to, you know what I'm saying, the old school Lace Dubray right there. The 82, the oval shape, I believe right now, it's like a, a rectangle. But this shoe is all the way quality. We got the leather insides, you know what I'm saying? 
You know what I'm saying? We got the JC on the back for the Joey crack. You got the nice tear squash stitching right there. Like I said, people been trying to compare on pandas. This ain't nothing like a panda. I can tell you this now. This ain't nothing like a panda. Y'all can stop the comparison. This ain't nothing. This shoe is for the culture right here. Your shoe guy, I actually had the privilege uh, to meet him earlier this year. And he actually told us about me and the homies. He told me and the homies, you know what I'm saying, that these was coming out. I could have made a video. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. You got the black and white. You got the, uh, the color I wore in the back. The uh, green and The OG. Yep. They all coming out. It's OG. Nothing changed. And uh, the sky blue and white. That's going to be in Miami. No, I don't own the store in Miami, but in Miami. But is it Khaled got one now? Yeah, he got one. I'm sure to be there. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be time. Yeah. All of them. All of them. I know one. Are you gonna get your hands on? We gonna get our GRs. Yeah, you gonna get you gonna get your hand on two of them. One of them is gonna be friends and family. Friends and family. These was coming out. I could have made a video a long time ago. You know what I'm saying? Oh, these are coming out, but I I wanted to wait till I got the shoes in hand before I even got to talking about it. But like I said, we did have a chance to meet him at our local shoe store, DVA Present. Shout out to them, Roman and them, you know what I'm saying, the, uh, and Hype Beast KC that got that uh, little thing with the shoes. You see my boy, Joey Crack, he actually signed that. This next one is, y'all probably already know, if you a sneaker here, you already know what it is, you know what I'm saying? Because you know your boy, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to go overboard, you know what I'm saying? This next one, I try to cop it off social status, you know what I'm saying? I'm a year, but they didn't let me know if I won or not. Look at them, you know what I'm saying? So I... Had to slide to go to cop this one. You know what I'm saying? So I did cop both pair that came out. The black and white ones came out September 16th. These one came out September 8th. And this one reads Air Force One Low QSTS NY. And the color reads white and purpose and purpose. I don't know if I got that right. Let me know in the bottom comments. Let me know. This one comes in same. You know what I'm saying? Classic Air One paper. You know what I'm saying? Doesn't great, but these ones just woo -hoo 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 -hoo. these ones. He did that. Basic white, black and white colorway right here. I see you, Joe. But then you put the icing on the cake with these. Woo! You know what I'm saying? Different color blocking, but they he came with the ice bottom and he came with the with the blue on the back side. Joey crack right there. Blue laces, you know what I'm saying? One low tear squad loyalty. I love this pair. Can't wait to rock this one right here. I don't know what I'm gonna wear with it yet, but I know I got it. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Joey Crack, what he doing for the shoe culture, man. You know? I'm happy with, you know what I'm saying, with the black and white Terror Squad. Loyalty Terror Squad. You know what I'm saying? You did your thing, Joe. You know what I'm saying? You told us we were going to be able to get our hands on at least two of them. I got my hands on at least two of them. Now I need to get my hands on that friends and family pair, you know. So, shout out to Air Force One, Nike, Terror Squad. Shout out to the story. Shout out to the sneaker culture, man, you know. Shout out, you know what I'm saying, this right here, you know what I'm saying, probably one of my all-time favorite cops of the year. I've been waiting to do this video all year, no lie, you know. And I had the joy to share this with you guys. Like I said, I actually copped this pair off a of goat. This pair, yeah, I got it for uh, under 200. I ain't gonna, I got under 200, you know what I'm saying? Close to retail, I ain't mad. I'm your social status, at least let me know next time. This one, I actually hit on sneakers, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to sneakers. Sneakers been popping. <laughs> you know, sneakers been popping. But you know what I'm saying? Shout out to the culture, shout out to the sneaker game. But I, I do want to drop a couple more things before I get up out of here. I do got some other things planned. Next video is actually going to be an actual interview that I did this summer 
with one of my uh, close sneaker buddies talking about this bench that I'm actually doing an actual video on. So, you know what I'm saying? That's going to be the next video. Stay tuned for the next video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, drop a comment. You know what I'm saying? Let me know how I'm doing in these, you know what I'm saying, these reviews. You know what I'm saying? I like my reviews to be a little different and everything. You know what I'm saying? But please, just, you know what I'm saying? Make sure you subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Hop, drop a notification on there. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know what I'm saying? I, so you can get all the newest content that I'm going to be dropping because I ain't stopping here because I got some other stuff, you know, that I ain't even got to. You know what I'm saying? It, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm ready. You know what I'm saying? That right there, I already got that one set up for. That's actual my childhood shoe. You know what I'm saying? My first pair of Jordans right there that I got as a kid. You know what I'm saying? We're going to do that review too. That's coming up. So like I said, it's your boy Super Dave. I'm out. You know what I'm saying? Stay tuned for it. You know what I'm saying? All the new Fit never slip. Get a grip. Get the stick. I'm then try it. Y'all hot hands compared to a Colossus. All of you are little giants. I'm Mount Zion. Too high and way too wicked. I'm Cristiano Ronaldo. So can I kick it? I'm still conflicted about the way I'll be depicted when I die. Martin Luther is straight killer. But what's realer? No filler. Spit that shit that stick to your ribs. That's soul food. I told you how pros move. And my glow up was so smooth that it feels genetic. My forefathers left me the game. Blame them and Jim Crow for making the boy vicious and superstitious. Crack mayors and make wishes. I got the nickname from my uncle on the ball court. Five was the number and Jake